Hey guys, what's up? JT here, and I just want to talk to y'all for a minute. So as you guys know, I have been a server for a very, very, very long time. And I've learned a lot. I've learned so many life skills and so many little pieces of tip, little tidbits of advice uh, that, oh, that really you can kind of only learn as a server. So one of the main things that I learned um, that I'm still learning is that confidence is key. You never let them see you sweat. Regardless of how I'm feeling, regardless of what I have going on in my personal life, you have to push forward. You have to be you have to be very uh, resilient when you're when you're in the weeds and this table needs this, this table needs this, this table needs this. You have no help. We're short staffed. There's only two servers on. The other server's busy. You got managers doing this, managers running around because you want their head cut off, food runners, busters, everything. You just have to stick it out and stick through it. And you have to do it in your everyday life too, guys. You just have to stick it out, and be strong, because you can always overcome anything you put your mind to. Another thing uh, that I've learned is that there are good people in this world. There really are. Not everybody is mean and out to get you. There are some really cool people in this world. There are some really good people that want you to succeed and that see that you work hard and they're willing to help you do that. And I've learned that uh, through these tables that I have these conversations with that I tell my story to. And uh, they're like, you. Know, it takes a lot of guts to pack up and move to New York City with $400 in a dream. Another thing that I've learned from being a server is that you gotta pay it forward. Everything in your life you have to pay forward. You, if somebody gives you something, if somebody blesses you with something, somebody helps you out with something, do what you can with it, do what you need to do with it, and then when you get something extra, that little bit of extra that you have that you can afford to not have, give it to somebody else. Whether it be financially, emotionally, mentally, verbally, give it to someone else. And another thing I learned from serving is the appropriate way to tip. For instance, if you eat $100 worth of food and then you use a coupon that takes $25 off your check, that leaves $75. Tip on the $100, not on the $75. You didn't use a coupon for my work, you just used a coupon for your food. So tip your server on the original amount. And since we're on the subject of tips and money, something else is that the more money somebody has, the less manners they have. I'm just going to leave it at that. Oh, and another thing I learned is, I don't know if I'm living in a different world or something, but apparently, menus are meant for looking at pictures, not reading the words. Read your menus, people. Read your menus. An oh, another thing that being a server taught me is how to carry an entire table set. I can carry two cups, a bowl, three plates, a spoon, a platter, and a shrimp basket. All in one hand. I've come to the realization, being a server, that the only doctor I need is Dr. Scholes. He will take the pain from your feet. Woo! I need to go get me another pair of Dr. Scholes centered in your and last but not least, the last thing I learned from being a server is that we make the best party animals. When we get off work, we've had a long shift, we were in the weeds for two hours, and now I get to have a cocktail? Oh yeah. Are any of you guys servers out there? If you are, tell me what you've learned from being a server down in the comments below. Give this video a big thumbs up. It lets me and YouTube know that you like the things that I'm doing and you want me to make some more videos. Make sure that you guys subscribe to me here on YouTube. Click on the little green subscription box. It should be down here. And make sure you guys add me on social media. That's Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, Periscope, Twitter, everything. I'm there all the time. Add me, follow me, subscribe to me. Let's do all that good stuff. If you want to see other top 10 videos like this one, click right here. And I recently did a collaboration with one of my great friends, Shelly Coco. If you want to see that video, you can click right here. And remember, a thumbs up means you like me, and a subscribe means you love me. I love you too. And I'll see you guys next time.